Hey guys, it's Eli. I just wanted to do a little quick review on a device I've been using for a little bit. It is the Aristec Aris Jonas. Um, this little device, it can use 510 cartridges and jewel pods. Um, I actually decided to pick up a few jewel pods. I didn't get name brand. I did at one point. I got um, the mint ones in the 3% uh, milligram or something like that. That was nasty. Um, no offense to jewel smokers, but I'm not a fan. I picked up a, like, four pack of the variety pods just so I could, like, try out the flavors and it, it, I'm not a fan. Um, so I don't really use the jewel part as much unless I forget my mod or my batteries die because I'm using, um, the vapor cloud. I'm using some old tech right now. Cause we found a bunch of coils and I love the flavor on this tank. Um, but this kills my batteries because it has to be like between 120 watts to 190? 170. So kills it really fast. Um, but I've been using this little guy for a while. I have a CBD cartridge on here. Um, I can't remember. I've had this one for a while, so I can't really remember where I got this one, but um, it has, let's see, three different uh, voltage settings. The green is 3.4 volts, blue is 3.7 volts, and red is 4.2 volts. I keep mine on green to keep it, well Ryan messed with it and now it's blue, but you can change it by pressing it three times. Okay, yeah. It's uh, green now, which is what I like it on. It's a lower voltage. Um, helps me make this thing last. Because I usually take longer hits, but because it's not as hot, it's not going through as much. Um, it's a micro USB on the side. And um, actually, I was really excited about this because I thought I could put the jewel pot in and... Um, my cartridge, sorry Ryan just texted me, it distracted me, but, hold on, if you take this guy off, I'm snaky now, this comes in a bunch of different colors, um, the shop that I went to only had this and silver, but there's like a rose gold pink, there's an iridescent, there's a bunch of them, there's juice leaking in this cartridge pack. Um, I'm going to see if this one's the sour berry belt. Oh, shit. That one is the raspberry mint lemonade. That one's nasty. Um, tastes like straight into my garden and pull out a bunch of mint. So, ooh, here's the jewel pod. It's a little knockoff one that's filled with 6.5% uh, salt nick. You just pop it in there. And boom, now you're good to go. That's nasty. That's really nasty. Why do you guys do this? Nope. Nope. That one tastes like old lady perfume mixed with like the bed that they sleep on. Like my grandma's sheets kind of taste. I want to try a CBD jewel pod, but if the flavors are all like this, I, d I don't know if I want to. Um, it's comfortable to put in my mouth, yes, but yikes, it's gross. So I'm just screwing on my CBD cartridge again. <laughs> I use my foot to hold it. Um, but yeah, this is actually a really nifty device. If you actually do enjoy jewel pods and I mean, you can use dab carts and stuff on this. 
let's be real. Um, it's a neat little device, all-in-one kind of thing, so you don't have to carry around a mod, a pod, and your dab stick and all that jazz. Um, so if you're looking to like consolidate for very cheap, um, I picked mine up at a local shop. I want to say it was around $30, but I've seen them online for $20-ish. Um, I haven't seen this exact item on any of my affiliate links, so you're just going to have to look for it. Um, once again, it's the... Come on, focus. 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 The Aris Tech Aris, and the Jonas is just black. Um, this is made in China. 510 pod or cartridges and pods are not included. Um, and it has a 650 milliamp battery. It also comes with a USB. It doesn't have any like quick start guide or anything when you pull it in. It was literally just like in the tray and then in the bottom of it was the charging cable. There's nothing on the box. You kind of just have to figure it out, but it's really easy to figure out. Um, you just got to play around with it for a little bit, and you get the hang of it. But yeah, I definitely recommend this. Ryan's probably going to pick one of these up soon, because he loves hitting mine, and it is a weird shape, I will admit, but after a while, it just becomes really comfortable, especially if you're right-handed. Uh, ooh, I'm left-handed, but I can still hit this comfortably in my left hand, but my phone's in my left hand. And I've only had to charge it, I want to say three times, and I've had this for two months now. I got it back in, no, I've had it for one month. I've, I got it back last June, but I hit it pretty hard. Um, this thing stays on me all day, every day. I travel with it. It's never had an overheating problem. Uh, Ryan plays with it when I'm with him. We both really like this. I'm probably going to pick up the iridescent and the pink one just because they're really cute. And I would like to have more of a variety of batteries for quick vapes instead of just carrying around a model all the time. But yeah, um, go check it out. Tell me what you think. Have a great day, y'all.